think we stayed here as long as we have because uh, I, I really grew to like it. I, I don't think I've ever had a job where I really think I could enjoy it and, and stay interested and focused on it for as long as I have here. I found out that, that I like living here. And when you go out to the community and you tell people where you work and what you do, I think they usually have a positive reaction. They say, oh, I used to go into the park to play in the stream or I used to go hiking there and they still do it. Being an aquatics person and a kid that grew up playing in the rivers and streams, it, uh, it's really cool to have a half a million acre office that you can literally go out and only have fun in, but also work in, and uh, just be blessed to work in such a rich and diverse place. We do meet a lot of people. I think that's uh, probably the best part. I really enjoy helping the campers, the hikers, plan their trips back into the woods, so I enjoy that part too. I would have to agree. I think meeting people from all over the world and people that have never been here, we help them plan their trips. They come to the counter and it's just very rewarding. I talk to people inquiring about campgrounds who've been coming here for 40 years. They came here when they were a kid, they brought their kids and now their kids are bringing their kids to come. The best part of my job is that it really varies, that you never know what's going to happen next. You never know what's going to be around the next bend on the trail. It's a lot of fun. There is a real sense of satisfaction, especially working in the sign and carpentry shop where you get to make things and put your hands on them. Leave something to posterity. is so connected to so many people, millions of people, and their memories. It's a part of them. I think what means a lot to me is knowing that when I'm enjoying this cookies, I'm walking the same paths that people have walked with their families for generations. Everywhere I go, I have some of the greatest views. I tell everybody my office has a view of 520,000 acres, and it's mobile. I love the people that I meet. Every day is a different day in the library, and a lot of the public that I meet happens to be descendants of people who once lived here. They spend a lot of time here looking at the materials that we have and reminiscing. The beauty, the beauty of the Smokies. I mean, you got your clouds covering the mountains, the scenery itself, the valleys, the hills. I love the outdoors. Our mission is to discover everything that exists in the park and I, I feel like to preserve the park you have to know everything that's here so I think what, what we're doing at Discover Life is part of that. I love everything, the hiking trails, the history, uh, it's a great place to work, everything. <laughs> seeing kids blossom when they come here and seeing them uh, get in a completely different environment and um, become comfortable in the woods for the first time. When I left the Park Service retired, I couldn't wait to get back and volunteer on the trails and lead people on hikes in the park and do tour bus tours. It made you want to come back and do all of it over again. It's an idea that was born here in this country to set aside land to preserve and protect. It's also, to me, a special opportunity to share what I think is really remarkable about this country, and in particular about this park. It's just a remarkable place to learn about our cultural history as well as our natural history. Occasionally I'm asked, what was my favorite assignment? I always respond, my time in Great Smoky Mountains National Park. There may be mountains more majestic, but it's the people that really matter to the Smokies. The ancestors created a national park, sacrificed for that national park, and today the descendants keep her strong. Thanks to the staff and the local people, I think there'll be many more happy birthdays for Great Smoky Mountains National Park. kids like to come here which makes me feel good because I have great memories of coming here when I was growing up. I hope that in the future more people will undertake the same sort of efforts. You need to have quiet places 
where you hear the birds sing, where you see the animals at, in the evening time, and where you have time to think and, and just appreciate nature. Well, thank you so much. We appreciate the fact that you've uh, provided this for our enjoyment. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank, thank you. And thank you for all your hard work. Thank you. Thank you for your work in the past. Keep it up. <laughs> we need this place. It's just, it's very special to be able to come here.